this lab is the lab that we call, quote, the dirty lab, meaning we deal with pathogens in here. The other side is, quote, the clean lab. So we have our, our normal uh, cell culture production systems going on over there. So we try to keep the potential of those cell cultures from getting contaminated from here. So we do fish dissections here where we may have, you know, here we had fish that were looking for DHSV, but they also had a parasite. And mm -hmm. maybe they might have a bacteria. Uh, we don't, when we bring in a diagnostic specimen, we don't know what we might find. So we, we try to contain that activity here. And we have the, the clean side, uh, which is where we have our, our cell culture production system. We make the cell cultures there, then bring them over here to infect them. And we'd incubate them in uh, an incubator such as this one here. Where are we? Where we have our, our cell cultures, which actually will have cells adhered to the underside of the flask. And essentially, you can think of, of this as a living culture medium. As, as I mentioned, the virus has to get inside a living cell. So here we have a sterile bottle of cells that we would infect with material that we suspect having a virus. If the virus is present, it would infect the cells, and we would then see the presence of the virus by looking at the cell culture with a microscope. So we see the effect of the virus being in the cell culture. We don't see the virus because it's too small, but if we see a destruction of the cells, that gives us an indication that a virus is present. We don't necessarily know which one, and then we go on and do the second part of the test to determine, is this VHSV?